Hi, I'm Carly Dufford. I'm here at Body and Pole, located in mid-Manhattan. And I don't expect to be an expert at pole dancing by the end of today, but I'm definitely looking forward to the experience. I've been pole dancing since 2008, so pole dancing as a fitness or an art form or whatever you want to think of it as has been around like that for probably 20 years, but in the past five or six years it's really you know, escalated exponentially right. and it's becoming a really fun way to work out. I would say that the average age is probably 28, you know, something like that. Um, mostly women, but definitely a strong amount of men. When you are pole dancing, you do need to have skin exposed. So that's why we wear shorts and you know tank tops or bra tops, just like you know you would take in a, a yoga class, like a Bikram yoga class. You want to have like shorts and a sports bra because you grip the pole with your skin, which can be very difficult. It's hard to get used to that when you start um, because it tends to be a little bit painful. So Anyone can come in and take class. You do not need to have a gymnastic or dance background to take pole dancing. And I've seen some of the most amazing students come from nothing. No movement background, no dance background, and they just train really hard, and they have great teachers, uh, great movement teachers, and they become these beautiful, graceful, strong dancers and pole dancers, and it's really amazing to see that. If you have good teachers and you really love it, you can become a graceful, strong dancer. Okay, so here we have Sam, and Sam was telling me a little bit about um, how she does pole dancing competitions. I didn't know that was a thing at all. Can you tell me a little bit about that and how you would even get into that? Uh, it's definitely a thing, um, all over the world, actually. And there's many competitions now that you have the option to do kind of whatever style of movement and dance that you like. Um, I tend to stick with the gymnastic style flips, handstands, and sporty moves, but there's a lot of different competitions for artistic and comedy and dramatic and doubles and groups and everything, so it's actually really cool. The last competition that I was in was the Australian Pole Fitness Championship, which was held at the first Arnold in Australia um, a couple months ago. So that was really kind of fun. Wow. And uh, I placed second in that one. So I'm not, I'm not too mad about it. That's really cool. It was cool. a lot of fun. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's uh, one of the ways that a lot of people get to showcase their talent and um, show what they love to do.